So the first thing we're going to go over here is how to put the vent in its mouth. You start with the arms back, put the vent on this bottom plate, and then these arms swing up onto the top of the vent. Now here, it could catch this oxygen tubing. If that's the case, just push it out of the way. And then you've got two red buttons on each side. You pull those out, slide the arms forward, and those should lock into place. Okay. So in order to put equipment on these mounts, you need to make sure whatever your equipment is, it has this bottom plate on it. So what you'll do is you'll line up this plate with this, slide it on there until you hear a click, make sure it's secure, and then it should freely spin. All right, and then take it off, you push this red button in here, push it all the way in, and slide your equipment off of the mount. Okay, so these mounts can only mount one way on each side, and you can tell which side you're gonna be able to mount it on. This, this hole right here lines up with this metal part that's attached to the plunger. So for this side, I can only mount it with this facing this. So I have to mount it this way. If I take it off and try and mount it this way, as you can see, it won't securely fasten in there. All right, so in order to get the mount down, you pull this red plunger here, pull it out all the way, lift directly upwards on the mount, and then you can fold the mount down. And to put the mount back up, simply raise the mount, put downward pressure on it, until you hear a click and make sure it's locked. All right, in order to remove the mount, first you have to remove this safety pin. So grab this metal part and pull directly out. It should slide out pretty easily. After that, you pull this red plunger on the back to release the mount. Pull directly up and the mount slides right out. Do the same thing to put it in, just in reverse. Make sure the mount is secure in there. Push the pin back through, and now that mount is secure.